Welcome back to Jackson County High School for part two of our broadcast here on PRTC TV, streaming live on Facebook and our YouTube page. Mark Selfridge, TJ Isaacs, Austin Whitehead on our mobile camera, and Jesse, the dancing outlaw Sparks, <laughs> here with me to uh, bring you uh, the second half of our broadcast of the annual donkey ball game. And Jesse, if you had to describe the first half of this, how in the world would you? Absolute pandemonium, running wild like Hulk Hogan. It's uh, been pretty chaotic, uh, to say the least. We got uh, we got one donkey out here that uh, Paul Bunyan couldn't ride, I don't think. <laughs> but looks like the white helmets have scored. And the black helmets are trying to get on the board. Got a little problem here. And we got a little, uh, little difficulty here from Jacob Mullins, who passes it way ahead to his teammate. Pass. And she is trying to, she's trying to wheel her donkey with great down the floor, and it is coughed up. Look at the determination. Black, black helmets recover. Over to Jacob Mullins, who mounts his donkey but gets absolutely hacked by the wide helmet defender. And the chaos continues. We've got a stampede for the ball here. Yes, and it is out of bounds and kicked back in. So 7.25 left in the third, what would be the third quarter. Two nothing wide helmets. And it is a loose ball tracked down by the wide helmets. And we are on a slow break. <laughs> Got a little hacking going on. Must not be no fouls. Oh, guy riding sugar loaf looks to be a little too big to bear for her. I mean, that's... That's, that donkey's not made for a full-grown man. That's a lot of donkey. We that's a whole lot of man on not much donkey right there. We've got a shot that's missed. Yep, got another shot attempt by the wide helmets. She followed it's her no shot good. There. Jacob Mullins, who's just been controlling the glass this game, picks up another rebound. And i tell you what, that guy was standing behind Geronimo right there, and he's braver than I am. I want your little sugar loaf out here. He's about to get rolled. I tell you what, you get behind, uh, you get behind one of these donkeys, you may get a kick out of it. Well, I hear before the game they told the donkeys to just kick it. That's where the game started. So you better, better be careful. Sorry, folks. Please don't turn us off. <laughs> <laughs> and another loose ball here, tracked down by nobody, rolling out of bounds. We got an inbound kick going on here. And we've turned this into a soccer match. <laughs> and the race is on for the basketball. It ain't the Kentucky Derby, but it's close. You couldn't be any more right. As the Black Hammonds are about to get the ball. All right. Black Helmets with the ball now and a heave hold to the half court line. Looks like Tate, who I suspected cheated the first half, but he's actually got on a uh, a different mule now. So we'll all retract those statements. He's got a wide open pass to the lane. He's got a guy up ahead. Now he's just a good hand. No, I don't think that's Tate, is it? I don't think so. It's really hard to tell, honestly. I mean, everybody's got a black helmet on. They're riding a mule. There's Sugarloaf. I mean, subbed up. Sugarloaf, I tell you what, it's going to have a bad back time this sucker's over with. Everybody gets on her. It's too big for her. You need to lighten the load on Sugarloaf. It ain't fair. The white team with the ball. Wide helmets now with the ball. Pass up ahead. And here we go. And he is pulling his donkey at lightning speed. Uh, it's a speed. A I don't three. know if it's lightning. And I mean, that was a Hail Mary. You can't blame him for trying it, though. No, I mean, what do you got to lose? 
We've got a full court pass ahead. He mounts his. I'm going to call that donkey secretary. Go right ahead. All right. And I tell you what, I can tell by looking at that one, that's Geronimo because the person riding it is on the floor. And I have yet to see anybody that could get on Geronimo for longer than one second. I think the PBR is here to see who can ride Geronimo. I tell you what, uh, you may need a PBR when it's over. <laughs> Jesse might have to go down there and uh, show them how it's done. Show them how we did it in 2008. Yeah. And Kyle Perkins with the long one, and it comes up a little short. As it's rolled and back it's, in. It's rolled back in now. Here we go. We've got another three-point hook shot. Looks like coming up. Oh, it's oh, a pass. Oh, no, it's a pass. And the shot is up, little, and the iron unkind for the Black Helmets. Little free throw line jumper there. Got a full court pass ahead. As the wide helmets have the ball now, if he could just turn around. And here we go, down the other way. Three minutes to go in the third quarter. Wide Looks like open. we're going to have a wide open basket here, and I mean that was just a terrible miss. You can't afford to have that, Jesse, if especially, you're going to try to win this game. Especially in this game where, where good shots are such a rarity. Yeah. There's no horsing around right now He's for the wide hand. Another shot at it, though. And this one's good. I don't know if you've heard how they get the donkeys into the gym. They they actually unlock the doors with a don key. Well, I'll be. And uh, they just walk them right in. Yeah, you, well, you learn something new every day. As you can see out of the uh, mobile camera there, our Austin Whitehead down there on the floor, he's he's pretty brave. He might need a, a dusting off time this is over with. And I'll tell you what, this event right here is a janitor's nightmare, baby. You better get the Lysol out. The germ X. The germ X. There's, there's exhausts from the donkeys all over the floor. It's like a slip and slide out there. You, they fall off and they're flying everywhere. I mean, I bet the store tomorrow will be out of Ajax. They are going yeah. to get it while you can. I'm sure. And Band-Aids, wherever that big yep. guy went, he's going to need a box of them. As we've got another. One minute 50 left. The, the uh, black helmet's making the charge here. She tried to steal it from her own teammate there. And hey, look, Geronimo takes another victim. You ain't riding Geronimo, pal. Give it up. It ain't gonna happen. And he's on him right now. Let's see how long he lasts. No, see, he's that, got that move down pat. There now, that's is. a textbook move right there by Geronimo. You can tell he's put a lot of practice in to that move. He's been getting ready for this game all year long. And here we have a pass up ahead. Is that the buck and duck by Geronimo? Pass back to the uh, hash mark for the white helmets and his donkey. He, you, you, listen, if you're the white helmet, you can't throw it to this guy. He's got an impossible donkey to try to if, ride. If I didn't know any better, I would say that guy is Carl Mulone. I there. tell you what, you could be right. Here we go now. White helmets are actually black helmets coming back with the ball now, and I think we're a little confusion here. We got we're not sure seconds. what's going on. Uh, I'm kind of – there we go. Uh, Geronimo just running around crazy-like. We had a steal with white team with the ball. He's got 39 oh seconds Lord. left. Oh, throwing elbows now. Here we go now. Wide open lane to the basket. And oh, I guess oh, he I guess a, this is not his end, right? No, this is black the black helmet's in. Uh, under 30 left to go in the third quarter here as we're trying to do our best in this chaos. He's got a long way to go yeah. and a short time and to I, get there. And looks like that I think that's speedy. He's got another gear, speedy does. Here we go. He's gotta find it. Well, and he's also got the uh, We've got ten seconds left he, here. He's also got the ejector button. Geronimo just dumped another one. Ger Geronimo early on donkey MVP for most buck offs in this game. All right, third quarter ended without a uh, injury. We will be right back here on PRTC TV. There's so many great things about life in gig country and PRTC is proud to be one more. A local internet provider with all the speed and reliability your family needs backed by hometown service and support. Whether you need to just check email or power multiple Wi-Fi devices all over your home, we've got the right package for you. Stop by one of our friendly offices 
Give us a call or visit us online to learn more. PRTC, your local internet connection. It's been a tough year, and PRTC is here to help by providing the emergency broadband benefit to qualifying customers. While the allotted federal funds last, if anyone in your household qualifies for certain government benefits or has lost substantial income this past year, PRTC may be able to provide free broadband or reduce your current broadband bill by up to $50 a month, one discount available per household. Visit GetEmergencyBroadband.org now to learn more. PRTC, keeping you connected. Fiber-powered internet from PRTC is fast, crazy fast. Experience crazy fast internet speeds from PRTC with reliable downloads up to one gig. Now you can surf, stream, game, chill with speed to spare. And with our new Gigaspire Blast, you'll enjoy the ultimate Wi-Fi experience everywhere in your home. Accelerate your internet. Contact PRTC to sign up or upgrade your internet today. All right, welcome back, everybody. PRTC TV, streaming live on Facebook and YouTube. TJ Isaacs, Mark Selfridge, Austin Whitehead, myself, Justin Lakes, and my good bud, Jessica Sparks here. And we're underway. And we are underway. No, no, uh, no injuries so far, surprisingly, but may have a few donkeys come down with hay fever. Very well could. <laughs> Here comes Carter Cunningham. He mounts uh, what looks to be Speedy. He's got the ball here. He's got to find that gear, though, that Speedy has. We saw it I, earlier. I tell you what, Giddy's got a little, or Speedy's got a little giddy up in him. I said giddy up and Speedy at the same well, time. This Here's is, a long uh, cross court pass. And enough, as right. you know, as you know, uh, this dude here, uh, this guy here with the basketball, he, he switched donkeys, as you can see. He didn't want no part of Geronimo. He almost took out a very expensive camera. Austin might want to move. Some, some that great, thing will come out of his paycheck if he don't. Some great action shots there by Austin Whitehead. Yeah, Austin, you're a brave soul. Do whatever you do, don't get that camera broke. <laughs> All right. So here we go. And black helmets now with the basketball. This is where I, I would slip the donkey $5, trying to get it, trying to bribe it a little. Well, we talked earlier, the strategy here is to take a carrot out of your pocket, throw it towards your basket, have your donkey chase it, go score. And the shot from the black helmets is up and no good, out of bounds, thrown back in by some random person. Here we and go. here goes the ball to the half court line, black helmets retain possession. Very throw it nice ahead, pass. probably might have broken that elbow there on the pass, might need to go to the horse middle when this is over with. And uh, black helmets, white helmets actually with the ball. This is the guy I was talking about. Uh, if you didn't watch the first half of this game, this poor guy right here, he took a beating from, from Geronimo, my man. He just really, he really got the business end of Geronimo. And now he's got another, uh, he's got another uh, donkey now. And that's, I think that's a smart move. If I was him, I would have burrowed my way away from Geronimo. With the ball here, is that's Pete Mulevich out there. And and here it goes again out of bounds. And I'm surprised this, to see him back out there. That's I am the, too. I thought he was on his way to a, to a clinic of some kind. Great determination. Here we go, Black, Black Helmets with the ball here. Yeah. She, with a pass. And we've got a free throw line jumper. It's a line drive thrown out of bounds and that ball will be thrown back in. And white helmets recover. Look at that rebound there. Yes. And he mounts his mule and here we go. Oh, and looks like, I'm t yeah, so this guy's on a different mule now. I'll tell you what, him and mules are like He's Oil a, and water, my friend, they don't mix. He's a mule trader, he is. He really is. See him at the stockyards. Here comes Tate now. With, and is he on Geronimo? This is going to be very, he is. Oh, no. Now, now we're going to see right here if he's a cheater. Ah, he throws it. He throws it away. We've got a wide open shot you here. You can see Speedy now. He's so fast you could almost call him a yam he haw. I mean, I blinked and almost missed him. Uh, yeah. He, so here goes the shot up. It's good by the wide helmets. And that'll, they'll take a 2-0 lead here with 6.20 left. 
in the fourth quarter. We've successfully made it this far than anybody breaking an arm, leg, or. We've got a slow break coming on here. Yeah, here they come. Gets to the three-point line, what's he gonna do? He's fixing to get it stole, and <laughs> apparently the white helmets uh, mule is playing for the black helmets team, oh, and an absolute section. truck right there, baby, a block from, uh, from like, the hills. Look like the Kimbe Mule Tumbo Long out there. pass down the court. Wide Helmets dragging his mule and he gets called for the travel. Oh no. I think that could be the first travel in donkey basketball history right there. We may be seeing something that no one's ever seen. We, we've actually. Uh, and we see the reason now for the stoppage in play. Well, as we've got a little extrament here on the court. Well, there's one thing about it. Everybody, you know, tries really hard this game. You can't say the donkeys don't give a crap. I well, mean, they really They try really hard. do. And I tell you what, when they do, they give about 10 at a time. <laughs> you know, it looks like. And so we got a little uh, donkey duty timeout. Yeah. Yeah, not enough oats in it probably. Okay, so here we go. We got it cleaned up now. Let's hope the ball don't roll through that. That'd be right disgusting. Back underway here. With 544 Wait. left in the game. These are very crucial minutes here. As so you got to clean up your own donkey's doo-doo, I see. I believe you do it yourself. Uh, you know, yes. I think I'd be feeding my donkey cheese if it was me. I wouldn't want to have to do that. Well, we should say you do do it yourself. Yeah, you do do it, but you do not want to do it. <laughs> All right, Black Helmets here with the ball. Let's get serious. Here we go. Very crucial moments here ticking it's down getting here. getting down the to game. the nitty-gritty here. Just under five and a half left to play in the fourth quarter. Pass down low. And it's up and no good. A little bit of trivia here. The donkey's favorite singers are Hall and Oates, I do believe. I think you're uh, probably right. I mean, it makes sense that it would be. And Black Helmets retain the basketball. Under the goal here now, makes a move. We've got a pump fake. And it's up and no good. You can't miss from that close to the rim. You just can't. You have to take advantage of those opportunities. Unless you hate winning. And uh, in that case, you can miss all you want to. It's like there's been a lid on the rim here in this last quarter. Yeah, if you're the white team here, you gotta you gotta put your uh, your best hoof forward and uh, try to get back in this ball game. Uh oh, he wagged his finger there, oh, a little taunting. Oh goodness. Uh oh. And now we got a little trash talking. Kendra oh, might need to step oh, in man. here and get control of this game before I it gets mean, out of hand. It is getting real. Oh, you're getting elbows thrown oh, now. No. I don't know. You're you're cruising around and getting a technical now he here. And he throws it away. We go, uh, let's throw back the end of the black team as he frantically turns his donkey around. Yes. We don't know much about the donkeys except for Sugar Loaf. Uh, we asked her before the game who her favorite NFL team was. She said the Colts. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, well. I couldn't believe that. I mean, her, I, you uh, know, I thought, you know. Them being from the old, up toward Ohio, you'd have thought it had been Bengals, well, but no. I, I listened to her earlier. Her, her least favorite NFL team is the Cowboys, believe it or not. Well, see, you know, I mean, that makes a lot of sense that it would be. And here goes a heave hole, and it's uh, missed terribly and is go. rebounded by nobody just yet. It's, Looks it's, like everybody is pretty much wore out from this. Going to be a little, going to be a little sore in the saddle tomorrow. We've got a race for the ball here. I don't know if I'd call it a race, but we've got something for it. As he is kicking his donkey, trying to get it to go. It looks like he has succeeded. Is he on speedy? i tell you what, you'll know it if he's on speedy. I, I think that second gear is ready to kick in. Yeah, speedy's got a gear the rest of them don't have. This is where you give a quick and a yes. yeehaw. Right here's where you toss, you do the carrot toss. You get down there close, because you got to score. You're down two. Here we go. We'll it's bucket. up, and it's no good. With the offensive rebound. Here By come. the wide helmets. They're not out of it. And there goes shot. a Moses Malone hook shot, and it's no good. Kareem Abdul Jabbar there. <laughs> and <laughs> the boss thrown back out to half court. I got to give you credit. That was pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I actually hear these, these mules are trying out for the Dallas Mavericks later this evening. Hopefully they get in. Here we go, we got the ball at half court. 
Great defense there by the white team. The pass ahead, if he can turn around, there's two minutes left here in the final quarter. He's going the wrong way. He's He's been uh, through the desert a, on the mules no Got name. a loose ball as our cameraman Austin gets involved in the action. Here we go. Pass ahead to the white helmets. This is a huge opportunity here for the white team. He's kicking his donkey. He's going the right direction. Here we go. Free throw line jumper is, is off the mark, out of bounds, thrown back into the black helmets. There's a minute and 45 seconds left. Very you know, crucial. You know, if nothing else, maybe when this is over, we can play pin the tail on the donkey. You know, I was hoping you'd say that because I was looking forward to it. And the black helmets throw it up ahead. Here we go. This is, I'm not, we not give this, um, this mule a name. I think his name is, uh, is that Thunderbolt? Uh, well, you, that's what we'll go with for the next minute and 20 of this fourth quarter. Here we go. Shot is up it and is. it's no good. White helmet's going for it. Black helmet's going for it. Big moment. Here. Minute 10 oh. left, and we've got a scramble for the loose ball recovered by the white helmets. We have a stoppage we here. Have a, we, we have a we uh, – we've got a big heaping stoppage in play, a big steamy stoppage in play. Well, these animals are well fed, as you can tell. Uh, Great view of the floor there by, Aust by our cameraman, Austin. Might want to watch how far you zoom in there. Don't want to get none on you. As we're waiting for, uh, and I tell you, whoever had to clean that up, I just, I feel for you. It's not worth it. Austin, it just ain't. Austin couldn't get any closer. Oh, and this is, you know, this is one of those, yeah, this is one of those ones that's just going to leave a mark. Whoever's going to have to clean this up tonight, Whoever's going to have to clean this up is going to be sitting here thinking, why do we do this, and why am I getting paid this to do this? Because I'm just – this is ridiculous. Right. I mean, the, the most important thing after something like this is you don't want your team to take a skid here at the final <laughs> moment. That's exactly right. Now – Hats off to Austin. Okay, now you? we've got it somewhat cleaned up. I mean, you can see the, uh, the shadow of what once was – on the floor. I mean, they've, they've left their mark here this evening. They have. Austin with some great footage. You can't get any closer without cleaning the lens. I tell you. Here comes, uh, we've let about five or six seconds mysteriously go off the clock. Uh, we got a minute five, minute four. So here we go now with the action. White team and with the ball. This is very crucial time. There's a minute left. They are down by two. And nice recovery there a as she break. kicks as she kicks old Brownie into high gear. Here we go. And it's going to be close. I tell you, she's only got 45 seconds left to get there. Here she's, we go. She stalks the rim. It's up, and it's That's good. Game. It's good. Tell you what, they feed those donkeys no, ice water. I tell, I tell, you, tell you what, you. that it's was actually that veins. actually puts the white helmets up by four points. Uh, oh, some wow. some of these some of these guys have got. They've got the wrong color helmets on, but it's okay. Uh, We've got a here, last ditch so, effort so, here. So here's what I'm saying. Geronimo still not being rode. So if there's an MVP for worst mood that a mule could be in, it's got to go to, to Geronimo. He's just been hateful all night. Yeah, they ain't uh, riding. Here we go. Heave, heave. Ho at the buzzer. Hits the top of the backboard, and the white helmets – Take this one four to zero. But we're all winners here this evening. Yeah, if you came out, you were a winner, definitely. It's very entertaining. For a great cause, it's, local FFA. Yeah, local FFA chapter. All the, the money uh, benefits them and their uh, endeavors. And it has been a pleasure, and it's really been different <laughs> bringing you this broadcast. Uh, I guess there's really nothing left to say about this. Uh, even though it was a great game, it still kind of stunk. And <laughs> anything you want to add, Jesse? Well, you know, it really you, you really saw there the determination here with these animals and these riders, and uh, really looking forward to next year. You know what? So am I. For T.J. Isaacs, 
Mark Suffrage, Austin Whitehead, who could be cleaning his shoes off right now. <laughs> I'm Justin Lakes, and for my man Jesse Sparks, who might want to steal Sonny's. Eat your heart out, Sonny. Yeah, yeah get some at Sonny. That's how it's done. <laughs> we'll see you next time, hopefully, here on PRTC TV.